Stegman. He, is, he talks tech very Love well. It. Larry talks tech very well. Uh, Larry's going to talk Black Friday deals. Now, not those Black Friday deals. We're talking Black Friday being the Friday after the Thursday of Thanksgiving. Good morning, Larry Senneback. Hey, good morning, guys. How are you doing today? Morning. First rule film. You have wowed us and you've dazzled us before. You're up. What's going on? <laughs> well, you know, Black Friday's coming up, and it's always a good time to get some good deals on tech. Mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, you know, if you want to go battle the lines and everyone doing the same thing. Mm -hmm. So this week, a lot of the major retailers have put out their ads for Black Friday and announced their deals. Yes. Mm -hmm. And really, the big takeaway, we'll go through some of these, is that if you're looking for a 4K TV, mm -hmm. this might be your time if you've been All waiting. All right. Okay. So, All right. Let's so, talk 4K TV. Okay. Let's because people in your office yes. have been trying to tell me not to buy a 4K TV. Yeah, myself included for a long time. <laughs> I mean, it's 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 they were just too expensive. Okay. And the prices you knew were going to fall. I mean, for the past year, they've been $2,000, $1,600. I mean, they're expensive TVs. Well, let me give you some examples of some deals on 4K TVs you can find this Black Friday. So... A 60-inch, so we're talking very high-end Samsung 4K TV at Best Buy, mm -hmm. is now $700 off on Black Friday and is $799. Okay. So it's much more reasonable, especially for a 60-inch TV. It's a very large TV. So it's clearly the 4K being $800 is less than the 1080p 60K. Or it's, or it's about even. Yeah. Well, yeah, you're right. It's about, about the same. Yeah. Uh, Walmart also has a 50-inch uh, Vizio, so a, a lower-end TV, but it's still a 50-inch 4K TV for $498. All right. Let me ask you this question. Mm -hmm. We're going to blow out the segment because sure. 4K. Mm -hmm. The argument you and your people make at First Rule is mm -hmm. that there's not enough content on 4K. I don't get the benefit of 4K. Why sure. should I buy a 4K TV? Well, for the last year, I think that's totally accurate. I mean, there hasn't, unless you were a PC gamer like myself, like if PCs actually can do 4K no problem right, right now and okay. have been for a while. Sure. But unless you're doing that, the Xboxes, the game consoles, they only do 1080p. Your Netflix, unless you watch one of a couple shows that they have in 4K right. and have the ability through a computer to play it in 4K, right. you didn't have it. But here recently, we've seen with the Apple event and a lot of other announcements that you know their Apple phone now shoots in 4K. A lot of the phones shoot in 4K. So they're starting to get enough content so out So if there. I shoot my phone in 4K and mm -hmm. I show it on a 4K TV, that's 4K. Yes, it is. Okay, but it, the Super Bowl is not in 4K. Or even if the Super Bowl is shot in 4K, it's not 4K all the way down the line for, for me to see 4K. Yeah, and I, I don't know. They might be doing a 4K broadcast of this if this year's Super Bowl, but you have to have the right equipment. You right. know, your uh, provider, if it's Charter or right, whoever, but, would but have to if, be able to provide If that. you have Charter, mm -hmm. they're, not, they're not giving you 4K capabilities. Not unless they specifically say so or they've given a box that can do that. Right, so the yeah. 4K TV is great, but mm -hmm. it's higher than the highest resolution you're provider can give you for most content now that's correct though i would imagine in 2016 you're going to see a big push to 4k content and even i know it's crazy 8k content uh, in the broadcast realm <laughs> i actually believe that 8k is where we'll stay and then 4k is actually an interim step come on for reals yeah yeah because uh you, right now we have displays that can reproduce almost as many colors as the human eye can see so we can't do too much more in the color realm though hdr is coming and that's really cool <laughs> um, so really, we have to improve the resolution. The human eye, she sees it a very, very high resolution. Okay. Now, if you're sitting 10 feet, 20 feet back from your TV, it does not matter okay. at all. Right. But if you're sitting very close to a screen, higher resolution actually does a lot of things. I have been in the store, and I've stared at a 4K TV, and it is phenomenal. Especially you get right up on it. The pixel density is amazing. But you get it home. How close do you have to be on it? You know. Well, I, I guess it just depends. It, there's other things that can come from high pixel densities. But, you, but but right. But also, what I'm watching on television, even with Directv that claims to be in 4K, is that mm -hmm. real 4K? If they say it's in 4K, and uh, then yeah, it probably is. Yeah. The, the box it can come through. Yeah. And YouTube right now complete support for 4K. So there's ton most 4K content out there right now is actually on YouTube. So if you're looking for a 4K TV, this Black Friday uh, it's a good time to pick one. But I'd have to play it through my computer. Correct. You can hook a computer up to it uh, right now, or a 4K player, which there are starting to. Get okay. What about the new Apple? Is that 4K? The Apple TV is that now, 4K? Now that's that was the weirdest thing about the Apple event when we were talking about it. That all of their new devices shoot 4K, but their Apple TV does not support 4K. It was a very weird choice on Apple's part. You think they would have pushed it? You would think though. Yeah. All right. So Black Friday deals. Any other Black Friday deals? While you know, there's uh, very quickly. They, uh, Walmart's got seventy dollars off iPads. The iPad 2 Mini. And um, that's a pretty good deal. Apple that's products good. don't usually get 
discounts. Yeah, yeah. The other one that was interesting, Target released its ad today, 15.6 inch touchscreen laptop, pretty decent, $250. So a very good wow. laptop for 250 bucks. You really can't beat that. Target so. HP. F- I'm going to go right now and go buy that right after the show. Yeah, that's a not pretty a bad sweet deal. deal. Really? Yeah. 250 bucks for a laptop? Yeah. yeah, it is good. And that's a Do real. You, need f- it? you don't need another laptop. Well, this one's a little. This one's a little you, slow. Kelly, you can't have enough left. Oh. <laughs> this is a little slow. For me. <laughs> okay. Uh, Larry Senneback with uh, First Rule Film and Broadcast. He is our tech guru. A 4K TV uh, at Best Buy for 799. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. A good one too. Wow. Uh, Larry, thanks for coming in. Thanks, guys. 823 Big 550 KTRS.